Oh my God! Whoa! It's trophy stream. What? Whoa! We're streaming. Hi, everybody. What? Hi, Nathan. Hi, Karina. <laughs> Hi. Hi. We're streaming. What? <laughs> We're literally. Hi, what? Wait, what? <laughs> we're actually literally streaming. Right we're now. literally streaming? Yeah, it's actually. Right now? Happening. I'm not joking. Oh, heck. I'm not messing around. I'm done messing around. We're streaming. Wow. Wow. How's everybody doing today? Welcome to the Droppy Stream, where we draw on the stream. I can hear oh you my gosh. Now. We're doing a real intro Julia. to the stream. <laughs> Julia's, Hi, here. Julia. She's, a, she's a baseball fan today. Yeah. Julia's got my <laughs> initials on her hat. Oh, wow. Oh, she's a yeah. big fan. Big <laughs> of fan you. Of Nathan Yaffe. My favorite we team. all are. The Nathan Yaffe's. <laughs> the Nathan Yaffe's. Oh, my we're God. Good, you know, we're a pretty good team. This. I got to do this to see chat. You are just causing me no It's just injury. me. It's just me on the team, but I'm pretty good. It's like a bowling team. It's like a bowling team. In which there's only one person. Is that how bowling yeah. works? That's how bowling works. Is that how bowling works? I think it's bowling been. teams yeah. have multiple people. I thought what? that the team would imply <laughs> that there's yeah, I, more than one. They start, it's like the score is, but I is don't cu know. cumulative between all the... I don't know. I've never been in a bowling league. Any bowlers out there want to yeah. um, explain bowling in chat like five minutes from now when we're not looking uh, Every, everyone else will know then at least yeah. i should i should share my screen because yeah, this is. this is a drawing stream <laughs> ostensibly this is a drawing stream we do draw here uh for your entertainment <laughs> we're also chatting this is a we're real mood just, just having a I had to draw a fast mug. This is a oh oh it's seven. Okay. Okay, I'm here. That face when that face when it's seven and you got to stream. You gotta do the droppy stream. <laughs> okay. Nathan's mic is louder than the others. I'm loud today. Wow. I'm in a loud mood. Is it possible? I'm loud to match to go further away. Julius. From you? Okay. <laughs> is that is that a, an option? How's this? Have? Is this better? Is it better this way? Because I switched to the snowball mic and now I have no control over my volume anymore. And so it's just everyone has to match us now. Okay. I'm holding the string okay. hostage. Is it specifically Nathan who's loud? Nathan is always Nathan louder. is always louder. <laughs> <laughs> Nathan is always louder. Nathan has a lot Nathan to is... say is louder than me realistically but in microphone land nathan is louder <laughs> jacob's not quiet yeah. everyone shut up <laughs> oh jacob are you a little mousy little quiet boy again this week <laughs> oh yeah julia you missed it last week jacob was a, a real quiet yeah so uh, small <laughs> a little tiny quiet friend I really thought if I switched to this snowball mic, it would make it work better. Why do you think that? It doesn't seem like that's the case. <laughs> Why do you think that? Julia is the most quiet of all. She's not said a single thing. Hi, Julia. Yeah. Hi. Hi, Julia. How are you? How are you feeling? Uh, I had to take a nap in the middle of the day. I thought I was getting better. And then today I felt like crap. But, you know. And now you're there. here. One day is in my right. Yep. I, I took a nap. I took a nap for like an hour. Oh, wow. I can never take a nap for just an hour. <laughs> Takes me an hour to fall asleep. You can fall asleep for just an hour if you have two cats that are not oh. used to you taking a nap. That's the secret. I see. The cat's cat alarm clock. Yeah. That fuzzy, that fuzzy alarm clock. And a loud neighbor that likes to have very long meetings where he talks for the entirety of it in the backyard. He must be an important <laughs> wait meeting backyard meeting. Yeah, like over the phone. Okay, he wants to have the uh, he wants to have like the the nice natural background, yeah. so that his coworkers can't see his gross apartment. Yeah, yeah, he's flexing his 
superiority by being in an outdoor space a luxury yeah <laughs> All right. nobody's happy with our volume so Aww. i'm gonna have to try and fix it <laughs> I don't, I, I don't, just, I, I don't have a way to make myself quieter either. I think people are just, yeah. With but no, short I, of just like pushing the mic further and further away from me. I'm going to max out the volume on both of our mics, put it in front of my face, and I'm going to talk directly into it like this. Oh no, everyone's <laughs> getting a Jacob nerf. Is this better? Is this better for you? This, Does this make you happy? Is this what you want? It sounds pretty good to me. I really can't tell the, the volume zone. difference. Yeah. You sound, a, you sound slightly louder than you did before by doing that. <laughs> good. As long as everyone is happy. Am I now too quiet That's... though? I pushed the mic really far away from no, me. I think, I think we kind of have got it maybe. Okay. Um, what should I draw? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What should Nathan draw? Guitar fish. Uh, My Neopets. Turtle Town. Draw fan art of Karina's Neopets. Everyone should draw fan art of my Neopets. Wow. It's my new thing I'm trying to make people do. Finland. Finland. Fin just the country of Finland. A lot of ponies. Turtle dogs. Bowling mascot. Frog, frog, frog. <laughs> Scrumbus a ASMR Jacob I'm I'm not I'm not inspired by any of these is that is that wrong of me I should just pick no. one I should just pick I'll do a lot of ponies ping pong penguin I'll draw a lot of ponies. Yay. This is, this is like the warm up drawing for today. Sometimes so you just got to draw a lot of ponies. Just draw a lot of ponies. I'll do like Jacob horse style pony. Well, we'll, <laughs> we'll, do, we'll do a bunch of different because I have to draw a lot. So we'll start. Yeah, you can. Just mine's like, a good warm up because it's already wrong. Yeah. So you can't like do a bad job at a it. Pony is just a little horse. <laughs> it's just a little horse. Yeah, take the horse, take the legs, make them way shorter. This one's doing like a leap. How are you going to leap with such tiny legs? That's just silly. That's just called taking a step. <laughs> <laughs> if your legs are too short, you can't leap. You can only step. Nice try. <laughs> you thought. <laughs> One pony we can do. There's like, um, we can do the like even sort of like chonkier pony design uh, what, what about the Adventure Time pony? What's the Adventure Time pony? Do you watch Adventure Time? Uh, yeah. Which you remember the, the horse? James the Baxter? Up? James Baxter? Are you talking about James Baxter? Well, there's he... a horse that shows up and stares through the window. Oh, that one. Them. Not James Baxter. It's based off of Kate Beaton's horse that she drew in, in her comic. I'm gonna look it up, and it, it ends up being um, it ends up being the Ice King at the end of the episode. Wow, spoilers! Spoilers! Oh yeah, that one. That's a good one. Well, that's that's gonna be kind of similar to the one I'm doing, but this long one's... torso horse. We're gonna get all so. this is all sorts of ponies coming horse coming so. at you. Long horse so. <laughs> so there's this kind. This looks like a My Little Pony mixed with a sausage. Aww. And I like it. My uh, Little Slug. I really thought it was going to be happier, but it's not. This is a very, this is like a, a guardian is standing watch very stoically. <laughs> I love it. We're just going to fill up the canvas with ponies. Yeah. And then, and then let someone else go. I like that. <laughs> that sound good? That okay with everyone? Yeah. I love that. That's I love that for okay. you, Nathan. Give it like a, here we go. Just do it like, meh. 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 All right. There's one. I do like that Adventure Time pony. That one's like. Yeah, it's got the big <laughs> eyes that look at you. I don't know that it has it. Okay, there we go. I thought you just gave it like a human nose at first. No, it's got like a, it's, 
Oh, it's not even, yeah, it doesn't even have a nose. It's just, it's just this. Oh, yeah, yep. no nose, just mouth. And it's got his tongue sticking out. And then it's just like ears. Bottom. Man, I love drawing horses wrong. <laughs> yeah. We as a society should stop drawing horses correctly. Yeah, I mean, the medieval style uh, tapestry painters really had it right. Yeah, they were like, just <laughs> do whatever. <laughs> do whatever. No one's seen a horse, really. So Just describe it to me and I'll do my best. <laughs> I'm going to try and do the medieval tapestry style horse. It's like... <laughs> it's like... We were at the, uh, the, the cloisters. Uh-huh. It's that museum that's also a medieval castle. Ooh. place in here in the big apple new york city yep and um there's a whole room where it's all tapestries about like a bunch of boys got together to kill a unicorn yep uh-huh. and the way they depict the horses and the unicorn in those tapestries is truly excellent <laughs> it has such huge vibes of like you know it's it's saturday night baby get the boys together <laughs> we're gonna go fuck up a unicorn <laughs> <laughs> to be out with the boys fucking up a unicorn. I can't wait. <laughs> Till it's safe. Yeah, and they're like, like 10 feet tall and all around <laughs> the room. It's just like amazing story where they got the unicorn and they stabbed it a bunch and they brought it back and put it in like an <laughs> arena and stabbed it some more. <laughs> <laughs> they really got it good. Or unicorn. I've never been there. I should go there and go to the boys' room. <laughs> yeah, you should. It's a really cool Dude museum room. in general. Yeah. Just never never made it up there. Oopsie. This is it's, all just like one big field. So we're like seeing them all at like it just goes real deep. It goes real deep <laughs> back up there. Aw. We're, we're just sort of slightly above them. I guess we should get like one in the foreground, sort of like yeah <laughs> near us this is a shark no it's a no, horse it's a, it's a pony oh sorry oh there we go now that you have the ears <laughs> it's a pony it's the only difference between a shark and a pony the ears yeah yeah is the, the ears, ears. <laughs> and the chins oh like hey what's up is this a camera <laughs> Is this a camera? He said he thought he set the timer, but yeah, but yeah. he flashed it right in his own face. Everybody, everybody, get ready. Uh, can, can you delete that one? This one's sitting down, and the other horse is like, "No, but I looked cute in that one. <laughs> it's the only one I looked cute in. I'll crop you out. Put a sticker over your face." <laughs> That's the move. <laughs> Who's buzzing my phone? Who's buzzing your phone? What? Oh, wow. It's my freaking friends. Ugh. Talking in a group <laughs> chat. Hang out? <laughs> oh, my friends uh-huh. love each other and want to talk in a group chat. Ugh. Stupid. <laughs> every, every time I'm in a new group chat, it's like, it takes one day before I'm like, this must be, this must be muted. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That's really generous of you. I usually yeah, do it day. right away. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give it a day. I'll look when I look. <laughs> yeah. You're welcome. Thankfully these friends sort of only chat in it when they're like, Hey, are we going to do that zoom call tomorrow? Hell yeah. And then everyone's like, yeah, oh, you got a zoom call nah. tomorrow. Yeah, I got a Zoom call tomorrow Ooh. with my friends. Ooh. I'll do the other Adventure Time horse. I don't know if I know the other one. James Baxter? We did a, we literally did a an episode about it. <laughs> or he was in an it. episode. Maybe you did it. I'm pretty sure you were there. It was with that, that dude Cade from... Uh, Channel Frederator. I've never met anyone by that name. No way, dude. <laughs> you were there. 
I've not, I've never even done an episode of Drawfee Show. What? Okay. Who are you? Who even are you right now? <laughs> I've never live streamed on Twitch. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. We got an imposter Jacob. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah, I do remember drawing this. Imposter Jacob. Yeah, you just got to remember it's on a ball. A little ball. Yeah. He moves, he moves real smooth. And he's just a happy horse that everyone loves. <laughs> we love a smooth moving horse. If more horses did this, I'd be a bigger fan yeah. of horses in general. <laughs> Do you know what else kind of worries me about horses? We've talked before about how they're really big and strong. We always talk about how big and strong horses are. Yeah. It's actually kind of odd how often we talk about it. <laughs> I'm not going to retread how big and strong they are. We all know that. Yes. We all know gonna, horses are big and strong. Yeah. I have a different point to make about horses. <laughs> uh -huh. And it's okay. that... It seems like if you allow yourself to sort of open your heart to a horse, that that's like it for you. You're like, uh -huh. it's like the most people that love horses, love horses so much. And I'm afraid <laughs> that if I open my heart to a horse, that that'll be it. I'll have to like, <laughs> you'll turn into horse Jacob. <laughs> yeah. I'll turn into horse Jacob. I'll have to like get a horse and, and ride a horse all the time. And One horse girl. Yeah, yeah, I'll be. You'll I'll have be, all that horse decor. Yeah, I'll have the horse decor. <laughs> Number one horse girl. <laughs> yeah, I'll be. I'll be hashtag one horse girl. <laughs> <laughs> That'll be me. So I'm. I can't allow myself emotionally to. And then to you'll, love a horse. you'll share all of those weird horse memes on Facebook that one of my aunts always shares. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I'm going to see Jacob on Facebook posting the everyone has a horse they never forget <laughs> <laughs> from the horse mafia. <laughs> everyone has one horse. That's going to be We all know a horse. <laughs> yeah. We all know that one horse. <laughs> That one special horse. Yeah, you know. You know the horse. <laughs> I do have a horse I can never forget. What horse? What, right. Uh, what horse? The I, horse from the meme? When I was a kid, we did a family vacation in Colorado, and we did like a little mountain horse ride trail. And I was behind my brother, and his horse just took like the biggest poo-poo and pee-pee. Cause that's just what horses do. They don't care. Yeah. They just do it. Like while they're standing still, like now's the time I'm yeah. not walking, let's go. And it was just right in front of me because I was, we were like in a line <laughs> and that's just what I think about when I think about horses. That's a beautiful memory. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for sharing your beautiful memory with us, Karina. I don't think I've ever rode a horse since. <laughs> For no reason in particular. <laughs> I mean, you had this perfect experience. Yeah, I peaked. Yeah. <laughs> it's amazing that I didn't become horse Karina at that point. Well, if you had gone back, if you had double dipped in. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> then you'd be the one doing the names. <laughs> yeah. But I'm already halfway there. <laughs> And when horses poop, they really, they really do it. Yeah, it's, it's, <laughs> it's too much. <laughs> yeah, it's so much. It's like, what, I just know you've been eating like grass or whatever. Like, where'd you get all this? <laughs> they need to work on that. Where'd you get all this poop? <laughs> <laughs> Explain yourself. <laughs> Where's it coming from? Why is chat saying Jacob Malfoy? What does that mean? What does that mean? What does, does that, that mean? mean? I don't know what that means. Did Malfoy talk about horses a lot in the, in the Harry Potter books? <laughs> That's his real character turn moment when yeah. he decides to love a horse. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Shut up, Potter. I love a horse now. No, I don't everyone's need just to talk saying to you. Jacob Malfoy with no explanation. You have to. Just like we have to explain what we're doing to new people when they show up to which the stream. Which we do every time. Which we do every time. Uh, you need to explain to us what you're talking about when we happen to look 
and see what you're talking about. <laughs> Them's the rules. <laughs> no one is explaining it. They're just saying Jacob Malfoy. Were you diagnosed? Uh, diagno- <laughs> <laughs> diagnosed. <laughs> Noise. <laughs> Sorry, I still had horse in my mouth. <laughs> 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 diagnosed it's very funny to me <laughs> did you just give up on the whole sentence is it gone <laughs> i did finish it i diagnosed <laughs> <laughs> it's impossible now diagnosed is all there is That's when you have a really surfer bro doctor. Hey, bro, you've been diagnosed. <laughs> it's terminal, bro. Not noise. Not noise. <laughs> Sometimes a word will just be like, you can't, you don't get to say me today. Yeah. You don't get, get to that say all me the time. correct. Yeah. yeah. It'll be like, I just, I just want to say it. And I'll be like, no, you don't get to today. Yo, is that a slimy horse? This is sort of like a a little a little flat horse. I don't know what happened to him. He's Kinda just looks deflated. like a pancake. He's a little pancake horse. Um, I ju- this will this a lot of uh, ponies. Oh. This okay? This is okay. Did I do I it? I would say that is a definitely Jacob. a lot of ponies. Hi, Olive. She's coming through. I'm gonna I'm gonna stop then. Okay. Is it Karina turn? Yeesh. Yeah, Karina turn. Yeah. What should Karina draw? What should Karina draw? Hey. Where are you going, Olive? What's your plan here? What should I draw? Also, Dr. if anyone Surfer clips Bruno. that, I'm deleting it. <laughs> <laughs> Don't clip that. If you clipped it, unclip it. I'm serious. Um, it's going so fast, and so many people are saying Jacob Malfoy, and that's not anything. That's not anything, chat. Maybe, maybe people want to see it. I don't it's know not, what that is. It's not anything. I mean, it's it's clearly Jacob as Draco Malfoy. I was I was going to save this uh, PSD and I just started typing Jacob Malfoy instead of <laughs> Trophy Twitch. Uh, let's see, hot zombie, shark. Cat you already pile. did Sanrio David. Oh, Godzilla B stars, because the new Godzilla movie. Oh. Godzilla the new, the Sanrio. Eight, eight mm-hmm. verse, eight Godzilla verse Sanrio large. Godzilla was already a collab that happened. Really? Oh, yeah. that sounds fun. I want to look that up. Sounds cute as heck. I think it was with Gudetama. I love the lazy egg. <laughs> Mushroom man. Mushroom. Handsome Tin Tin. That seems like a <laughs> suggestion for Julia. Yeah. Hot Frog Man. Uh, I'll just draw Godzilla B stars. I don't know that much about Godzilla. Oh. Well, the what nice thing is about? they rewrite the lore every movie. So I think you he's don't... just a big boy, right? Yeah. yeah, he's a big. He's That's there's uh, again. There's no consistent size for Godzilla. It appears at different sizes in different movies. Um, because what there's like the the lore I heard, which which was wrong, it turned out was that it was like a uh, I guess in the the one that came out in like the the late 90s it was that he was a radioactive iguana yeah that's, that's one apparently of them. not that's not canon it's like a or nuclear... maybe it is 
Explosion. like the nuke. It, it's like it has to do with the nukes. It was like created culturally as like a a, a sort of symbol of the destruction yeah. caused by nukes. But then like the actual lore behind Godzilla is like maybe it's some sort of ancient creature that the nukes woke up or something. In the newest one they did, he was just sort of like a big lizard that was that lived in a cool underwater temple. <laughs> yeah. And that one guy goes down there just to do one pet. Yeah, and then he dies. He dies, but he gets to pet Godzilla one time. That's worth now it. Now Godzilla Godzilla seems kind of like maybe maybe not the maybe not the coolest guy in the new movie, which again, they just keep rewriting the the lore. Well, maybe King Kong's not the cool guy and Godzilla. Yeah, maybe King is Well, cool. King King Kong was pretty cool in uh Kong Skull Island, but then Godzilla was pretty cool in the Godzilla King of the Monsters uh, with Millie Bobby Brown. I mean, you know they're going to team up. You know That's, they're yeah. going to team up. Godzilla is you know fighting what? King Kong to make sure King Kong is still strong enough to fight Mecha so Godzilla can, or whatever the so big that they threat can is. Fight whatever why was Whatever King Kong big so monster. big? He's just a big, <laughs> just a big guy. <laughs> but why? Was there like a Skull reason Island... as to why King Kong's so big? He's the Is, king. Isn't he just big? He's just a really big gorilla. I like, think he's just it. a big gorilla. He was on an island being big and we found him and he was What like, made him big? Yeah, what made he him just, big? He's never stopped growing. He just kept doing it. Like that big crocodile that lives in Florida? Yeah. But even bigger, mm. because Skull Unnatural. Island. Yeah. Oh, I just noticed Joy's here. It's like you oh, know yeah. how some people, like one out of every bazillion people, will be like ten feet tall for no reason. Mm-hmm. That's like King Kong. Mm. He's just really big for no reason. Okay. Godzilla is big for reasons. All right. King Kong is big for no reason, and that's, that's why they have to fight. And that's why they're at odds with one another. <laughs> exactly. They come from two different schools of thought on being huge. They don't see eye to eye. <laughs> Godzilla was like, hey, why are you so big? And King Kong's like, what do you mean? <laughs> oh, what do you mean? I'm, don't ask me that. This is, just, this is just how big I am. And Godzilla's like, what the what? <laughs> but why? <laughs> that's not a satisfactory answer. I must know why. And then they fight. Yeah, and then they fight. <laughs> I've seen two Godzilla movies. Uh, one is that newish one that came out. Yeah, the King of Monsters. One. King of the yeah, Monsters. Yeah, that one was rad. I loved Mothra. Um, and then I saw one that was playing in the office, and there was a baby Godzilla. Oh, yeah. Remember that when they were playing on one of them TVs? Yeah, what? they just hung up on the wall. Which yeah. Godzilla was that? <laughs> TVs that they hung up on the wall and we never really used for anything. Yeah. They're Godzilla like, has <laughs> had several children, I think. Godzilla fucks. Because there's there's <laughs> Godzilla, Godzilla Jr. <laughs> yeah. But then there's also um, Manila. Manila? Oh my Manila? God, I just found it. Yeah, like, no, you're right. City? It is Manila. The one that we watched was the one with Manila. You mean Magilla. <laughs> Magilla Gorilla. Magilla, no, that's King Kong again. Oh, wow. Manila <laughs> that's is. His son. Manila is rough. Manila's busted. <laughs> We're, looking at... We're looking at pictures of Manila right now. Manila's like the original baby Yoda, but everyone hated it. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't have the technology to make cute baby creatures yet, but yeah. they, they were too ahead of their time. We watched Son of Godzilla. That's what it was. Yeah. That was a question on my episode of Um Actually, because I was on with a person who does like a Godzilla podcast. So that was that was for her to get. You should have done research and then then beat her at her own game. Well, I I still won the episode. I just didn't get the Godzilla question. You did win. I did win when I was on. I didn't. I I. Didn't do that many jokes, but I did answer a lot of questions correctly. <laughs> <laughs> you were there for one reason. I, yeah. 
and it was to win. I did some jokes, but mostly I just wanted to win. <laughs> <laughs> this Godzilla is giving me like uh like vice principal vibes. <laughs> He's the vice principal. But I started drawing him in a uniform. He's like the the big one, you know? You know yeah. in the yeah. anime there's the big one. He's yeah. a gamagori. Yeah, a little gentle giant energy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> is that is that an energy Godzilla has? I think so. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, I sent everyone a picture of, of the son of Godzilla. <laughs> <laughs> Why is his face? Manila? He took his face yeah. and went. <laughs> Why is he's it more, named Manila? He's more human looking. Yeah. Did Godzilla fuck a lady? <laughs> <laughs> this uh-huh. is a really good picture. I mean, that's I'd feel that way too if I looked like that. <laughs> Damn. But why Manila? That's my question. Cuz it's like mini, I think, like min minila. Uh like mini my, Godzilla. My my question uh my question did not I'm, you know, I'm just asking the questions, you know, I'm not saying anything definitive. I'm just asking questions. What's the question? I'm Did not going to say it. I'm not going to say oh. it again. People, people didn't like it. Eh? <laughs> well, maybe it was a giant woman. That That's what I'm thinking. So I, I love this big boy. You know, you can't, You're a giant woman and you fuck Godzilla. This yeah. is, this is the, the world we live in now. You Good can't for even you. Ask. You have options. <laughs> I'll never find someone my size to date. <laughs> <laughs> All I want to do is see Godzilla screw a giant woman. No. <laughs> <laughs> Someone just said that's the plot of Tall Girl 2. <laughs> God, I hope so. <laughs> that well, yeah, because they need to bring Tall Girl into the the like Godzilla universe so that they can yeah. have a crossover movie. She... Kong versus Godzilla versus Tall Girl. Oh no, Girl. there's a love triangle between <laughs> Short Boy and Godzilla. <laughs> Short boy brings his box so he could step up on it and slap Godzilla. (laughs) I like that. This is is just a cool, this is like hot uh, Doro Hidoro guy. Is that one not already hot? Well, not this hot. Is it as hot? it's (laughs) It's even hotter. This is Karina. I hate to break it to you, but you draw very attractive uh, characters. Thank you. It's in your blood. Just like I do. It's the just hotness pleasant. flows through you. Like I'm not, you know, I wouldn't, I wouldn't date this guy, but I, I <laughs> like, not? I see the attractive. Well, Howard. maybe, maybe you know, actually, you don't even know him. I don't even know him. You're right. If he was interested. Depends how he approached me, I guess. He's really I awkward. I shouldn't he shut comes the door. Off as very aggro. I shouldn't shut the door before it's even, you know. He's shy because I'm just, he saw I think Mothra I'm just, I'm just intimidated by him, to be honest. I don't know what Mothra looks like. <laughs> Mothra. Mothra. Oh, Mo- A beautiful Mothra. <laughs> I feel like Mothra is like that, that one. Um, the hot woman bug Pokemon, Pheromo- uh, Pheromosa. Pheromosa, we uh, caught a Pheromosa. Yeah. yeah. Over the weekend. <laughs> Fucking obliterated Pheromosa. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, we one shot Pheromosa with a G Max or Dynamax air- pheasant. <laughs> OP. <Airstream>. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're planning to do some uh, Dynamax adventure streaming. Yeah, we did one. We did one just for fun, just for fun for us. And it was fun for us. Yeah. Except I got to see Jacob just die every oh, single the, round. The final round was so funny. <laughs> <laughs> no matter what Jacob did, he just got obliterated. I got one shot on the every only, single fight. The only one we didn't successfully complete because 
they decided to just murder Jacob every yeah. round. So we I didn't no even lives left by the time well, we got Jacob to got the... murdered every round. And then it one then it shot killed... three of us at the same time. Yeah. yeah what was it? It, it was, was Kyogre, right? Used yeah. origin blast or whatever. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, is that what that was? It was, I bad. didn't even see it. It just happened so suddenly. <laughs> yeah. It went, it went rough, <laughs> but we got but, all the other ones. Yeah. Before that, it was fine. Yeah, we're going to do some live streaming of that because it was a lot of fun. Yeah. Emily Emily was so surprised when I told her that we weren't streaming that. She, <laughs> she had just assumed I had been streaming. <laughs> it's the same it's what assumption. you've been telling her. <laughs> I was trying specifically to like not suggest that we stream it. Yeah. So I could but, be like, but now we will stream it. Yeah, now we will. It was it's like, we yeah. can just do a thing. We don't have to content it. No, <laughs> I mean, we, we also can still, but it's like, we may as well see if we can get some money too. <laughs> <laughs> okay, get I'm it. Just gonna, I'm just going to wait. I forgot. Wait, they're down there. You know, they're down there. Yeah. yeah. They're down there. It's, yeah. It's a you baggy, know they're down there. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. Such a cute drawing. <laughs> I love it. This Thank is, you. This is wonderful. Is that me and Julia's time? Oh, I haven't been drawing well today, but I'm I'm gonna try. Well, this is after your nap. Draw anything today? Yeah, I tried to draw after my nap, and it, it just it, it's not working for me today. I just got one of, the, one of the bad brains today. It just don't. Sometimes Jacob just already don't. did a good drawing today. I I know I know that for a fact. Why do you know that? Because you because oh, you drew right. a drawing you do a drawing that's going in tomorrow's episode. I forgot I did that today. You busted it out. It was great. I was like, oh, dang. I knew Thank I asked you, the Nathan. right one. Yeah. I've done two drawings today, not to brag. Hell yeah. Oh, wow. And I'm gonna do more. Femme fatale Jacob. They've switched. They're off yeah. Jacob Malfoy. In Dark Crystal stream, OC. Last night, Ooh. Julia was wearing a, a suit, so I wore Julia's dress that yeah. she owns. And nice. We were playing Hitman. Oh, that's <laughs> what the fan art's of. That's oh, dang, I gotta, of, I gotta yeah. watch that VOD. That sounds like fun. I did a whole thing where I came out and I was doing a whole voice like, oh, Hitman. <laughs> Are you flirting with me, Hitman? <laughs> it's pretty good. Secret Sleepover Society, if you're not already subscribed, or following that you should what you guys do sundays and, and wednesdays nights that's true at nine that's both? true yeah thank you nathan for the shout out of course kermit hitman <laughs> i saw kermit hitman and hitman kermit <laughs> they're brothers handsome 1010 10. oh handsome 1010 10. do you want to do that one yeah do you okay. have do, enough room? Do you need me and scoot? do and no, do I'm share good. your screen? Do oh, share yeah. your oh, screen. Yeah. Thank you. Or I we forgot. could just like have people watch you draw and they can guess. Yeah, what it looks like they can imagine. Yeah. Okay. I'm so thirsty. I'm gonna go get a seltzer. Don't. Wow. You need, do you need anything? Thirsty, no. but it's only Monday. Whoa. Uh, uh, it's been a while since I've said that. So done that, done that one. It's pretty good, I think. Yeah, I like it. <laughs> Thank you, Julia. <laughs> it's a, it's a, it's a very me joke. I laughed really hard at a joke the other day, and I showed it to Jacob, and he was just like, "That's just a you joke. That's just a, you're just laughing at a joke you would have made." I mean, that's what. Yeah, we tend to make jokes of things that we would find funny. Yeah. <laughs> I have to look up references. Okay. Wait, what was the I, what was the joke? What was the joke? What was the I joke? That was very funny. It was like it was it was basically my anti humor again. Yeah, I don't remember. He's back. Hello, I'm back. Give me that hot tin tin, please. I'm working on it. I've already got this nice sort of 
head tilted back, like. <sighs> it's a classic hot person head angle. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Draz shared the Oh Hitman clip. Oh, Thank Hitman. you, Draz. Thank you, Draz. Thank you, Draz. I'm going to open that in another tab and save it <laughs> for later so that I can continue participating in this stream right now. The worst part of the stream is that people kept coming in late and then they thought that I was just wearing an extremely deep V-neck. <laughs> oh. Which I hated that they thought that. It's like, How no, dare... I'm wearing a, a beautiful dress. Yeah. I'm not wearing an extremely deep V. I'm not an asshole. You should have just stood <laughs> up the whole time. Yeah, that's true. I should have like over out. there. You should have been like <laughs> dancing in the background the whole time. <laughs> yeah. I know it's like the producer's so job to give you notes, but I'm I, those are my notes. I those are my dance. notes. I'm human. I'm not a dancer. <laughs> Man, Nathan, playing Pokemon over the weekend was fun, though. Yeah, yeah I, I want to do more. I've been thinking yeah. about it. It was so nice to not be stuck with three <laughs> PCs. I was playing some yesterday and I kept getting Martin and I had to be really careful not to let any Pokemon that know like dumb moves. <laughs> yeah. I would have to take them myself so that Martin couldn't take them. <laughs> Because he'll do it. He'll do he'll it. He'll do it. Drop of a damn hat. I was so mad because there was one raid I did where he got Clefable and he kept doing like uh, one of its support moves. He kept using like a non move. Yeah. It was either after you or some other one, the or it supports in a team battle. But I then, it. and I was so mad because he kept doing it. And I think one time he also had a Pokemon that used coaching on a Pokemon that was, or like some sort of support move the on a Pokemon that was asleep. Oh, God. <laughs> oh <my> God Martin. <laughs> so it's like, just the visual Martin. of that Pokemon materializing a whistle out of nowhere yeah. and whistling it was, it was at one a of the Pokemon ones that's that only for a Pokemon, like asleep. one Pokemon. And then the next turn, it was just like, it was asleep. And I was like, great. <laughs> thanks, Martin. You contribute so much. But on the one where he had Clefable, he won the entire raid because he was super effective on the last one. I was like, fucking Martin, I hate you. Oh, wow. <laughs> At this point, even winning makes me hate Martin. Yeah, I'm just it's like, just... all this time you fucked around and now you're like doing things correctly. <laughs> it's just that um, reductress headline, heartbreaking, <laughs> worst person you know. Just made a great point, or maybe yeah, yeah. Is, is that yeah. click? Is that reductress or click hole? Or I don't know. One of those. It's one of those. I'm looking it um, up. I want to cite my source correctly. I just realized that Hot Tin Tin is Lamillion from My Hero Academia. It's click hole. It was click hole. <laughs> Aiden, that reference was just for you. You're the only from one who knows My I'm talking Hero about. Academia. Say it again. Hot Tin Tin is just Lamillion from My Hero Academia. Yeah, it is. Everybody look up Lamillion, My Hero Academia, and you'll He's see. He's the one that looks like Tintin, right? He's the one that looks like <laughs> Tintin. And, uh? he, and he goes, power! Yeah, and he screams power. <laughs> he's a good character. Yeah, he's very good. Inspiring. Inspiring <laughs> character. Julia, you're drawing me. What? Yep, that's Jacob. You drew a Jacob. It's a, I mean... Am I hot ten ten? Could be. If you Damn. if you Wanted bleached your hair, maybe you could be hot tin tin. It's worth a try. This is reminding me of another character that I can't put my finger on right now. Jake Kind of, kind of looks like uh is this Riverdale. <laughs> <laughs> kind of looks like Dean Venture. Dean Winchester. <laughs> There's only one Dean <laughs> in this he, house. He could be a Dean Winchester. He's very yeah. middling. I feel like I'm thinking I, of I like... I always love the way... Oh, go ahead. I, I just feel like I'm thinking of someone from like a comic, like an American comic. 
Archie? Superhero Archie. comic, I think. Archie? It is kind of an Archie. Oh, is it the original looking... Spider-Man? Is it like the dude from Why the Last Man? Is that who I'm thinking oh, of? Oh, yeah. It does kind of look like York. Uh-huh. His name York? His name's Yorick. Huh? Huh? Yeah, I don't know. Why the Last Man's good. At least I think it's good. I remember thinking it was good when I read it. I read like a chapter of it, and now it's reinvading my brain. I forgot his name was Yorick. That's bizarre. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You shouldn't name someone that. Well, it's it's sort of a point. Of, like his his his, his, <laughs> yeah, his name's Yorick, and his sister's name is Hero, and they like talk about the fact that their parents gave them weird names. It's messed up. <laughs> Hero's a cool name, though. Is it Hero Yui? Hero Yui. Hero is the Yui. only hero I care about. He'll kill you if you're not careful. He'll kill you. He'll do it. <laughs> Speaking of people who will uh, who will kill you, I've I've I watched all of the uh, his Dark Materials series, all the episodes they have up on on HBO. Yeah, and man, that that Mrs. Coulter. Oh she's yeah, she's a scary, scary lady. She's great. She's a great character. She'll definitely kill you. She, she'll you kidnap could be... you and make you feel like everything's fine, and then she'll she'll just rip you apart. You could be on her team, helping her out, but if you hit on her too many times, she'll just she'll just kill you. She'll just be like, "I'm tired of you hitting on me, so you're dead now." Like, I mean, great. you shouldn't be hitting on people that you, much anyway. Yeah, I mean, it's a good lesson. <laughs> it's a good lesson. It's unfortunately you can't do much with it when you're dead, but also I guess spoilers for this book series that's been out for since like the nineties. A while, but I don't know. I don't know if they changed anything for the series. The Phil Pullman's like a executive producer on it, so Yeah, he was really excited about this version because he said that he would have more like creative control and and that he got to stick to the books a little bit more because a lot of uh studios are trying to like curb his anti-church uh stance basically in his books which seems like i don't based on the way the show goes i don't understand how you would tell that story without that the the first original movie did somehow and they never made more. <laughs> and then they never made more. It it's made almost one. like if you're missing a huge crux of the plot, it doesn't quite go as well together. Yeah. I should watch the HBO anyway, one. I, I enjoyed it. I, I'm I'm sure you you'd have more opinions on it as someone who's like such an avid fan of the books, but as someone who never read them but was always like interested. Mm-hmm. It's like, it's everything I want from like a a prestige television show. It's like cool world building, interesting characters, bears, beats. I always said that basically the first movie had the aesthetics, but not the themes. And then this one had the themes, but not the aesthetics. Oh, interesting. It's sort of like steampunky a little bit. The original one was steampunky, but it's like more um what is it called? Uh in, industrial industrial art. Right. It's like yeah. a lot of concrete buildings and stuff like that. I don't know. I found like this the like design of things was was thematic like the the way every like faction looks is like indicative of how you're supposed to feel about them which was cool I don't like think the watch. jordan college is very like 
you know, collegiate. And then like the magisterium. The college is collegiate? Is all, yeah, it's all like it's all like fancy and like ornate. And then like you get to the the magisterium and it's very like stoic and like clearly like powerful and evil. Look and at then... this clever thing you've done, Julia. Every time oh. I want to cheat a shadow, cheat a strong shadow, that's what I do. What a what a clever move. Clever move. Julia, you did it. Clever girl. You made a hot 1010. This is yeah. Dang. They said it couldn't be done. Who? They said 1010 will never be hot. Not in my lifetime. You're living in a dream, kid. Hot 1010 isn't real. He can't hurt you. Okay. Oh, yeah. Some dramatic shading. Yeah, that nap must have must have worked because this is fantastic. Thank you. Got big nap energy. Got that big nap energy. It's nothing you can't do. I don't know why I just did the the price is right you got it wrong song but here we are <laughs> this is this is also clone high JFK a little bit it's a it's lot like of dudes clone high if you if you drew clone high JFK in the archer style you probably get something pretty similar, but this is tin this is unmistakably Tintin. I think like there are lots of similar hairdos to Tintin, but this is this is reading as Tintin to me. Good. Yeah, I agree. My dad has a room that's all Tintin posters uh, in in his house. <laughs> that sounds so bizarre, like out of context. Because it makes it seem like that's the only thing that's in there. Like it's no. a room where it's just wall the to only wall decoration, Tintin posters. The only decorations in that room are Tintin posters <laughs> and plants. I'm going to my Tintin room. <laughs> if you need me, I'll be in the Tintinatorium. If you need me, I'll be with my Tintins. Me and the boys. <laughs> the boys are all Tintin. Uh, is this done? Basically. I think so. I mean, I thought it looked done before you added all the cool shading, so I'm not I'm not gonna tell you I want it to be a reference to the the spotlight thing. Yeah, no, it's Tintin good. Idea. But I'm saying Hot Tintin's like, oh no, you've caught me. Hmm, did you expect me to be this attractive? <laughs> You'll let me go, won't you? I'm hot Tintin. I love that Tintin is British. You remember me as that little boy. But now I'm a hot man. I'm a I'm hot, hot man. I'm a big beefcake now. You don't want to capture me. I'm hot Tintin. Yeah. I must be free. Uh, yeah, this is this is Tintin. This is great. Excellent work, Julia. Thanks. Really good. Oh, yeah. A little, little wet lip. Maybe I do a drawing. What do you think about that? Yeah. Okay. I think that's good. I grab my stuff. Oh. Assault. Jacob just punched me in the back. You punched my elbow with your back. Suggestions for Jacob. Hot Caillou. No. Next. <laughs> Agent 48. Corgi Paladin. Oh man, I want to do a Corgi Paladin if you don't do Corgi Paladin. Umbrella Man. Have I Hot drawn Haddock. a Corgi Paladin before? I don't know. Hot Baldo. Baldo is hot. Death, Death Metal, Metal Neopet. Neopet. I saw that one. I'm not going to draw a Neopet. That's outside my jurisdiction. Yeah, we would mess it up severely. 
I want to see it. <laughs> <laughs> you want to see Should death we... metal neopet? Mm -hmm. I'll do it. I'll do it for you, Karina. But no one else. Stop the no screen one share. Else. No one else can watch. Stop the stream. We're Which, sending it to the Karina. Stream. Which Neopet should I do? Do you have any suggestions, Karina? Of good. Death What's one that you Neopet? remember? I don't remember any of them. They all look like dogs to me. <laughs> you don't remember <laughs> Quiggle? I only remember my Quiggle that I drew. <laughs> draw draw that again. Draw the death metal your Quiggle. Is that what I should do? I need Karina's approval. Do whatever. Or should I do like a real one? Quiggle, your quiggle. Quiggle, your quiggle. You want me to quiggle my quiggle? Quiggle, your quiggle. Okay. Well, first I have to remember exactly what it looks like. The only, the only Neopet I remember is my Aisha. Is that what the name was? Yeah. Yeah, that neck. was that was during your um drawing subjects in uh in recline period on Drafi. yeah i remember it had it was kind of like it was a frog was also i believe the neopets episode was the first episode david edited the tongue i could be mistaken the, the tongue the tongue did something, something like that bad yeah right the tongue did something bad yeah, it was just, it was a big, it was a big sort of lumpy. This isn't even what yours looked like. No, this is a new one. I don't remember what it looked like. <laughs> this is this is Quiggle 2.0. I liked your Quiggle. I put it in our book. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna look it up. I it's on it. the coloring page. Yeah. Oh, the, t the feet were tongues. Wow, okay. What a thing I did. <laughs> it's not how it's I remembered cute it being. Ish. It's not how I remembered it being. Yes. <laughs> Let's bring it in. There he is. Get yeah. rid of this. Don't know what that is. That's that was closer to what a uh, quiggle looks like, probably. But this is it's gotta be death metal. What did Quiggle actually look like? It was just a frog. It's just a frog. Oh. Yeah. But there are no frogs in Neopia, so they're quiggles. Yeah, we got quiggles, we got nimos, no frogs. No frogs nimos. allowed. Nimos, oh. the other frog. Okay. <laughs> is that a is that the baby frog? Quiggle is kind of like a head is body frog. Nimo is like a long frog. Oh yeah, Nimo's like a rainforest cafe. Nemo. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it does look like a rainforest cafe mascot. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. We need to do another Neopets episode. Yes, we Let's do. Let's do another Neopets episode. Yeah, I would like that. <laughs> I also want to do another Hearthstone episode because there are more cards that I have their voice stuff stuck in my head for. That I want to see you draw. Nice. I'm when down. COVID's over, do you guys want to go to Rainforest Cafe? Yes. yes. Yeah. Do they That's still on the exist? List. They somewhere. I'm gonna look it up. They do. They never closed. My parents went to one for their anniversary once. Oh, I love this angle on the mouth, Jacob. The closest one is in New Jersey. We can go trip to yeah. New yeah. Jersey. <laughs> That's not that far. Yeah, it's, you know. Okay, it's South Jersey. South Jersey. I don't oh, wait, know what no, that there's is. one over here. This one's not far away at all. Eh? Eh? It's still in New Jersey, but it's not far. It's the, it's the close part of New Jersey. Is I'm it Newark? Fun of me. <laughs> what? Uh, it's Edison. Edison, New Jersey. I don't know what that is. <laughs> I don't it's know like, what that is either. Yeah, I mean, I only know what that is because I'm looking at a map. It's like just west of Staten Island, which is southwest of Manhattan. All I need to know is as the crow there? flies. Um, if we can get there, that's all that matters. I mean, we could get anywhere technically. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Amazing. Can anyone? We can go drive? by boat. Can you drive? 
Can any of us drive? Yeah. Julia I can, drive. can drive. I mean, we don't have a car. But you if we can, had a car, we can You can drive acquire it. cars. I can acquire a car. Yeah. It will take us 11 hours to walk. <laughs> <laughs> Better start. <laughs> It will take us three hours to ride a bike. It will take us 38 minutes to... The picture looks like a hitchhiker. Hold on. Bike. It's a hitchhike. It's a hitchhike. Um, it will take us almost seven hours via train. Why? Huh? I don't know. Not, a, not an efficient... Oh, wait, uh, I clicked it. It's actually an hour and 45 minutes. Oh, oh okay. it changed. I was about to say that literally doesn't make sense. <laughs> yeah, the train goes very slow. <laughs> Sleep yeah. in the train station overnight, then take a it train. It goes in the about twice as fast as walking. <laughs> Not quite twice as fast, but almost. Yeah. If you round up really generously, yeah. yeah. <laughs> The train's just on a bunch of little legs and it's just walking. It's worm train. <laughs> it's worm train. <laughs> that was the plan all along. Worm train only takes you from Brooklyn to the rain car, rain forest, rain forest, <laughs> rain forest cafe. Yeah, you got easy. there. You got there. That is the purpose of worm train. <laughs> Rain carist fafe is what I was. I love going to a fafe. Yeah, the the one with the the most rain car, the rain carest cafe fafe. Cafe. I can't even say it wrong right when I'm trying to. I have to try to say it wrong. Uh, it's all right, Nathan. You got there. Saying things is. It's like, it's easy until it's not, you know? Yeah. <laughs> you don't think, it's like when you, um, it's like when you bite your, your lip or, or uh, like the inside of your mouth when you're eating, it's like yeah. eating, eating so easy, eating so easy. And then sometimes your mouth is just like, actually we forgot. Like, whoops, thought we knew how to do it. Turns out we don't. Yeah, I get so irrationally mad when I bite my tongue or the inside of my mouth. It it feels like a betrayal. I want you guys to know that the first image that comes up when you look at this rainforest cafe in Edison, New Jersey, is a, a picture explicitly of Wilson's Leather, which is a clothing store. What? But then the rest of them are the rainforest cafe interior. Can we go to Wilson's Leather? I don't want to. <laughs> What? I want to go to the Rainforest Cafe. I only want one thing. <laughs> I only want one thing and it's disgusting. Can... <laughs> it's Rainforest Cafe. I thought we could make a whole day of it, you know? Is there a cheesecake factory by there? There's a cheesecake factory like, oh wait, two steps away. <laughs> oh my God, hold on. It's seven more hours by train though. <laughs> oh, the Rainforest <laughs> Phone's ringing, dude. Here? Hello? Okay, we'll do it. Thank oh, you. my God. Why do they never listen to the time we put? <laughs> this has never worked once. It has worked. It <laughs> have, has. You, have you thought that maybe you should <laughs> give up on this method? No, it works. It's, it's foolproof, practically. It's never worked. <laughs> I can't remember a time that it's worked. Well, listen, think of all the times that I didn't say, oh, I can't believe the food's here. And on can't, those times. Can't remember those times. Those memories don't exist. Yeah, I can only think it's of never them. happened. Think about when there was only one set of footprints in the sand. <laughs> it was then that the food arrived on time. That's a reference to the popular Christian short story, Footprints in the Sand that all Southern families have on their wall somewhere. We didn't have that because we're not fucking lame. Damn. <laughs> wow. Sound off in the chat if you know footprints in the sand. <laughs> Sound off in the chat if your family's not fucking lame. 
I know it. I know it because of Caldwell. Caldwell would like reference that, and I was just like, I I'm assuming this must just be a thing that like I don't know about because yeah, I'm Jewish. It was a thing. But I've never heard of that. So the whole thing is that it's like a guy is walking on the beach with Jesus or something. And he's looking I don't back. know if I want to know about he's this. He's looking back <laughs> at the footprints. And he's like, Jesus, how come in the hard times, there's only one set of footprints. You weren't walking with me during the hard times. And Jesus was like, you fucking idiot. There was one set of footprints because I was carrying you during the hard times. <laughs> I was like, oh, I was so stupid. I didn't should've... even notice I was being carried. <laughs> I wow. I thought I was walking that whole time. <laughs> Jesus, you're so strong. <laughs> <laughs> you, you made me think I was still walking. But, <laughs> but really, you were carrying me? Jesus was holding you're him so from the back talented. like this. So that he was, he was yeah. taking each step. Along he was still walking. It's just that his feet were on <laughs> Jesus's feet. They yeah. were holding their, their toes were clasped together. <laughs> <laughs> that's so romantic also, what, were the, what were the hard times they had on the beach well the beach is like a sort of parable for life as a whole i feel like if i'm on I've a beach had it with y'all's have, parables. Unless, unless it's like a, a, a shipwreck situation in which case you know it'd probably Julie, be good you to know have Jesus so the, the lesson is Jesus likes feet. Yeah, Jesus is in the feet. <laughs> what did I come back to? Do you know footprints in the sand? No. Damn, <laughs> it must have just been like a specific, because Caldwell knows it's, it. Yeah, you and Caldwell. They're like a Southeast <laughs> Christian white family thing. Okay. It was just a this like thing that everyone in the South knew the footprints in the sand. Everyone, story. It's, it's just a Southern thing. I've never, like I've never asked shoes. Caldwell to explain it to me. Every time he referenced it, I would just be like, "Sure, man, yeah." <laughs> David just messaged. Yep, <laughs> they know it. Saw. David knows. David said, "I'm Jewish from New Jersey, and I know footprints in the sand." Oh, David, thank you, thank you, David. <laughs> you beautiful champion. Was my interpretation correct that jesus likes feet picks? yeah they like holding like like when you do this except with your toes with your toes yeah, yeah. And oh. that's ultimately like at the end what it says yes it's it doesn't say anything it's just a picture <laughs> <laughs> of their feet doing that oh, there's yeah, a the cross McElroy's like emerging right above it, it. yeah <laughs> glowing yeah i don't it. know what this is why did this come up um, well, it's hard to Jacob said something. I don't remember. Why does anything we say happen the way it does? I already forgot why it came <laughs> up. Just know that in a different crowd, it, my joke would have killed. Everyone We're, would have been like fucking. What was the it. joke? I, I just made a funny reference. You don't even know. I do know it was that I was saying that the times when I didn't say the food had arrived early. <laughs> Those oh yeah, we were talking I, about when the I food. carried you. It's okay, so it's a it's a natural <laughs> extension from what we started talking about when you left. So. Yes. yes. Okay, Karina, I have good news for you. Yes, Cheesecake Factory is located in the same mall as Rainforest Cafe. Yay! <laughs> oh, we, we gotta go to double, the mall. Double header. I forgot that Jersey has like a lot of malls. <laughs> Jersey and Long the, Island. Is we that why malls. I know Edison? Is it because my friend from Jersey would just say that's where the mall was? It's yeah, it seems like it. To me. I like purged all of my New Jersey knowledge when I moved out. <laughs> well, you didn't need it anymore. Yeah. I thought you lived in New Jersey. Yeah, dark that's times. Right. No, it was okay. It was just weird. <laughs> it's okay. It's just weird. Yeah, you the county I about... lived in had like the, what do you, the, the laws, like Puritan, like electronics can't be sold on Sundays laws. Oh. Really? Yeah, because I used to live right next to the Japanese grocery and they had to um, tape off the aisles with the rice cookers on Sunday. Damn, <laughs> what? bizarre. Yeah, it was, it was weird, but I mean, I live Apparently next to Apparently it's called blue stuff. laws. 
Yeah. That's like wild. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot if that's what they were called. Blue's Clues. <laughs> David confirms. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, David. Um, Thank you, David. David knows about blue laws and <laughs> David's from Jersey. <laughs> and but yeah, I had never lived sand. somewhere with yeah. that stuff before. And I was just like, interesting. I'm pretty sure you could still buy alcohol on Sundays <laughs> after a certain hour, but not <laughs> electronics. What a weird place to draw the alcohol, line. but not electronics. Okay. That's wild. You can I, get drunk, but you can't cook some <laughs> rice while drunk. No. <laughs> well, you can cook rice. You just can't buy a rice cooker. Yeah. Don't you dare. Yeah, you <laughs> better buy that rice, rice cooker, cooker before then. If you were planning on cooker. having <laughs> rice on the Lord's Day. You better be prepared already. I just want Satan to pop up in that Japanese grocery store going, buy the rice cooker. <laughs> Come to my side, Don't buy the rice, rice cooker. I wish I could, Satan, but they won't sell it to me on Sundays. <laughs> <laughs> Do it. <laughs> Guess I have to steal the rice cooker. <laughs> Uh, I'm done with death metal quibble. I like it's it. It's very He's good. It's really good. I think I met the brief. <laughs> he really yeah. channeled his uh, personality into his uh, yeah. belt and pants. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> and his attitude. And his attitude. I mean, I imagine his singing would be a little rough considering his tongue is always completely hanging out of his mouth. I mean, it probably sounds like most death metal, which That's is like... What makes rah, 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 rah. Yeah, it's different. Uh, anyways, Nathan, you want to draw again? Yeah, I do. I'm still thinking about Satan and Jesus tempting people to buy a rice cooker. <laughs> yeah, they just stand at the entry of the aisle being like, <laughs> Satan's like, come on, come on. And Jesus this is just standing there with his arms crossed, <laughs> tapping his foot. <laughs> I, I want the equivalent. Giving you that look. <laughs> I want the equivalent of Jesus flipping out in a bank <laughs> and like tossing all the tables, but like the equivalent, <laughs> he's like in a cell phone store and he's just flipping tables. Flipping rice cookers. <laughs> flipping rice cookers. <laughs> you did. You did dishonor my father like this. I look back in the sand and it's, it's just, just bunch, rice cookers. It's just rice cookers all the way back. <laughs> and then I ask Jesus. Jesus, where were you? Why are the- you so <laughs> many rice cookers on the beach? Jesus, I can't reach the rice in the rice cookers. He said, you have to use the long spoons. <laughs> Stand on my feet. <laughs> Stand on my feet, use the long spoon. <laughs> we really... <laughs> I'm sorry if there are any religious people watching and this is uh, not doing it for you. I mean, when I was like young and religious, I still thought it was funny. So I say it's all good for everyone. We need yeah. suggestions for Nathan. Corgi Paladin. What was the one? Oh yeah, Corgi Paladin. Oh Was yeah, Corgi Pal- Corgi yeah. Pal- good memory, Corgi Karina. Paladin. Corgi Paladin. They also said it really early, and I read yeah. it. Oh, okay, good. And it was almost forgotten. Have then. I drawn that before? <laughs> Maybe? I hundred percent oh. forgot. Do it again, Nathan. <laughs> It'll be doing it again. This time. They asked. They asked. They they shall receive. D and D and cute dogs. Yes. <laughs> yeah, you, yeah, I'll do it. D and D and cute dogs, yes. Boy ice cream. Yes. Someone sent me a yes boy ice cream on Neopets, a ticket, and I don't know when they're. I think they already played this month. Whoa. I need to check the schedule so I can see yes boy ice cream again. Except I probably have- can't see them again because Flash is officially dead. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. What is yeah. Neopets doing about this? <laughs> Do they have um, a plan? <laughs> yes, but also, because, mm. um, I mean, I'm not going to speak for Neopets. I don't know why they weren't already working on this, but there's a beta. There's been a beta for a really long time of just, like, a Flash-free website, mm-hmm. but uh, it's not done. And <laughs> so... The site's just a real mess right now. I haven't been playing as much because I made all my pets look real fly and now I have a lot less to do. And the site's just like a nightmare to navigate right now because half of the site has been optimized. So it's on the new Flash Free website. 
And then the other half is just untouched because it has, you know, maybe it doesn't have flash things that need to be like fixed yet or whatever. So they're still on the old layout. And it's just like half of your stuff is on the new layout, which also doesn't have complete navigation, like all the navigations turned around and then everything else is on the old layout. I think, I think just like without you knowing what it looks like to point out like how weird the web design is right now. Uh, one, the search bar doesn't work on new layout. <laughs> it's a magnifying glass. And if you click it, nothing happens. Oh, Great. Nice. Two, That's what you want. On the old layout, if you click your Neo points at the top of the screen, it takes you to your inventory. On the new layout, if you do that, it takes you to the bank, which makes sense but it's taken you to your inventory for 21 years. Why change it now? <laughs> so the it's whole like site's just kind of confusing and weird. Yeah, it's, yeah. It's like when they changed the shift thing in Photoshop. <laughs> oh, they were yeah. like, actually, it does the opposite now. Yeah, yeah, you liked that, right? Just kidding. <laughs> so yeah, everything's just kind of like really messy right now, but they're like still updating it over time optimizing things that people want optimized right away uh all the games are gone there's like seven games right now that actually work and i don't know if you can get neo points from even playing them i don't know if they fix that yet mm. yeah everything's just kind of a mess right now but That's most wild. of the stuff that i like on neo pets still functions so <laughs> it's good <laughs> yeah i i still log in every day do my little doodads you inadvertently reminded me of a story <laughs> from my high school yeah where so a kid in my grade <laughs> was in the cafeteria during lunchtime was showing some magic tricks that they had learned with like a deck of cards uh-huh and like a bunch of people were watching it was like a small group it wasn't even a big group but then the principal was walking by and he thought for some reason that it was gambling. <laughs> Principals love to think that harmless yeah. activities are bad. Are gambling. Actually, yeah. Gambling. So he took the cards away in the middle of the trick. And he said, for some reason, the thing that he said after being like, you guys are gambling, and then everyone trying to explain, and then giving people <laughs> detention for participating in gambling, was, you could take that to the bank. <laughs> so <Yeah. laughs> Just click your Neo points. <laughs> <laughs> so then it became like the running joke of that year. Like everyone was in on it. Someone, <laughs> like it became the slogan for our high school <laughs> year. Someone made bank. a song based off of it. It was wild. <laughs> it was a wild time because it was just such like wild nonsense. We don't even know why he said it. The the wild nonsense from high school. It good sometimes. It Probably good sometimes. like <laughs> had an argument with his wife earlier in the day, and she said something no. like that, and he'd been like, "It just came out." Yeah, yeah, yeah. He did that thing where he thought of a cool line to say. The to jerk like store his wife. called. <laughs> <laughs> you can take that to the bank. That's what I should have said. Yeah. I'll yeah. say it to these kids. They'll have no idea what I'm talking about. Save that retort for later. It'll be so cool. It'll be so cool. Over the weekend, <laughs> I decided to revisit my high school feels and rewatch Gurren Lagann because I was. Oh hell yeah! I was like, I've been meaning to do that, so let's just do it. Yeah. And one very good everyone should watch Gurren Lagann it holds Great. up I haven't watched it since like high school and I was like wow I've never seen it I think that's so messed up we gotta watch it y'all you, should you've watch seen, it you've seen, you like Kill la Kill right oh I love Kill la Kill and I love mechs so yeah you think I'd see yeah. Gurren Lagann it's yeah wild. it's so fun it's can so we, good. Can we all watch it together? Yeah. I haven't we seen can add it, it since... to the many other things we said yeah. we would watch together and have. Yeah. We'll watch it at Cheesecake Factory. Yeah. <laughs> Rainforest Cafe. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Sitting amongst the trees, watching it on our 
<laughs> the thunderstorm starts. <laughs> But um, yeah, and then I went through my old Deviant art and looked at all of my Gurren Lagann fan art, and I was like, "Damn, I had no right being this funny when I was 15." <laughs> <laughs> that rules. I made a whole fan comic that I never finished called "Prom with Viral," where Viral asked Kamina out to prom. Oh. <laughs> And it was one big inside joke, but someone on DeviantArt got very mad at me about it. And I had to leave a very sincere reply being like, no, this is a joke. Because <laughs> apparently I didn't have a spine in 2009, but. <laughs> <laughs> no spine in 09. I got six pages in and, and then that's when the robot fight would have started. But then I was like, I can't draw this and never went back. That's Someday I'll finish fair. prom with Feral. <laughs> <laughs> it's on the list. No one can complain about two demons taking so long to upload when I haven't, up you haven't updated prom with Feral <laughs> in like 13 years. <laughs> Someone's going to comment on it and be like, I'm still waiting for the next page. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Because now people are going to do that. <laughs> oh, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> But it's okay because problem with feral is kind of funny so i don't mind <laughs> bringing it up on stream <laughs> it's That's a funny, so funny premise all of my gurren log on comics are funny gurren log on turned me into a shit poster <laughs> 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 it changed the course of my life <laughs> when i was 15. <laughs> That's beautiful. Thank you for turning me into a shit poster. <laughs> I'm literally this anime girl in Lagan. Yeah. Um, yeah, I really want to rewatch it. Y'all should like watch the... it. I made mm -hmm. Julia watch some of the hype fight scenes. <laughs> yeah, the other you day. did. Just because I really felt like seeing them. I just really wanted to rewatch the ending, and then I was like, I should just rewatch the whole thing. So that it's like especially, <laughs> especially good. Because then it really hits. Yeah. And it did. I've definitely drawn this on stream before. I'm realizing as I, as really? I, like, as I figure this, I, maybe it was on like one of my own streams. I maybe, think one maybe time maybe you drew a, like a Genji Corgi. Which oh, is maybe that's similar. Yeah. Similar that. idea. Yeah. Okay. But yeah. not the same. I, I've just like, trying to figure out how armor would work on a corgi i'm like i my brain has had to do this before for some reason you're doing a good job yeah thank you yeah i well again i've been watching the uh the his dark materials and just seeing the way they have armored bears <laughs> like, armored bears are so cool armored bears are so cool i oh, love yeah. yorick's not fancy but <laughs> functional armor yeah, Another he's Yorick. just the least fancy of all the bears. We talked about two Yorick's today. That's unacceptable. Yeah. Yorick Byronson. Byronson. I don't know what that show is. But chat just reminded me that Promare is on HBO Max now. Oh, Hell yeah. snap. We don't have the HBO. Damn. Yeah, we do. What? Huh? Oh, yeah. That's right, we do. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> Jacob, you <laughs> liar. You lied to us. <laughs> what a... What a twist. I also watch Promare. I also just rewatched that because I never watched the dub. And I was like, I should watch the dub. How's the dub? How's the it's dub? good. I liked it. How's the know. dub? How's the dub? Love a good dub. Love, Love a dub, dub dub. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> That's another thing I haven't seen. Promare. Put on the list. Put on yeah. the list. There it is. There it is. I just watched a very good Korean horror movie. Oh, it was fun. What was it called? It was called like Ganjam or something like that. I don't remember the exact name, but it was about a bunch of YouTubers, a bunch <laughs> of horror horror YouTubers going into a asylum to film like a horror special, and then of oh. course they get haunted. Darn. But it had some real good, real good scares in it. I thought. Nice. Some real fun scares. Ganjiam? Wow. Haunted <laughs> Asylum? I nailed it. Good I can't print. I'm probably butchering that pronunciation, in which I apologize. But oh yeah, I mean the pronunciation is not right, but I had the letters right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but it was fun. It was a really fun uh uh horror movie. 
And one scene had me very uh, scared. Oh. Just because the dude was really freaking me out. I have like one scenario in every horror movie. One fear. One that- fear. <laughs> With that fear dude. That one guy. <laughs> um, there's like one situation in horror movies that I always find absolutely terrifying. And it's like when you know this person is going to die and that person knows they're going to die. And they like cannot escape the room that has this monster in it. Aww. Like um, the newer Halloween, whatever that was called. Was it just Halloween? Oh, Halloween, I think. All right. When they're in the bathroom, that scene scared the bejesus out of me. Oh. Nothing scares me. I can't remember Nothing the last scared. time I've watched a horror movie. Yeah. yeah, someone in the Discord was asking about scary movies. I like scary movies. I just don't watch them. <laughs> I don't like scary movies. I mean, I already actively don't seek out media. So I usually only watch them with friends, which haven't I mean, seen those in a while. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, mean, I would I argue know. that the princess switch Two is pretty scary <laughs> <laughs> yeah fair once we can have movie nights again i i always love having people over to watch horror movies yeah yeah i, I can go home scared with the friends yeah yeah, yeah. we can yeah, record yeah. drawfee episodes and then everyone can stay for a late day and then we all yeah. just go and watch movies that's just what's gonna happen like once we can get together again I'm yeah, so we're just never gonna to leave your apartment. <laughs> <laughs> we'll and we're never gonna kick you out, and so. then and then we'll be like, "Oh, I got nothing to do, so y'all want to hang out <laughs> <laughs> forever." <laughs> 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 so many tangents. I should have planned this better. But... No, you're doing great. Yeah, there's no good place for that sword to go. Yeah. He's got to be holding it in his mouth. Unless it's a curved sword. But it's a paladin. It's Yeah. (laughs) It can't be. It's a paladin. It's a paladin. paladin I'm trying to do like a a scimitar. Yeah, I could, but I'm trying to do like an (laughs) I'm trying to do an aesthetic. This is like a a high fantasy. Just raise the whole spine of the dog so it's behind the sword. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You have to raise it out. Just erase it. It's gone. That's how I fix all my tangents. I just remove things. You got to cheat it a bit. Yeah, I'll be like. Spine is higher. It's it's whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Spine is higher. No, it looks totally good. Up over there. Great. We did it. Thank you. (laughs) We got there. Thank you for your help. (laughs) What if the pommel's a bone on the end? Yeah, dude. <laughs> yeah, dude. What about that? I love that. Aw. Hell yeah. That's why you picked it up in the wanna, first place. kind of want to do it. Like <laughs> yeah. He doesn't really care that it's a sword. He just wanted to hold the bone. <laughs> yeah, he just wanted to hold bone. Sometimes you just want to hold bone. This is the oath of bone paladin both. both thank you to everyone who is subbing and gifting subs and giving yeah. bits and all that jazz Good thank season. you thank you y'all yeah thank you all very much and sorry again that we don't do individual shout outs anymore yeah it would just be the whole thing it would be the whole you know thing. who you are <laughs> and you know that we love you and appreciate <laughs> yeah. you we see it so just thank you very much we like to take one time per stream to say thank you Thank you. And you never know when it's going to be, so you got to watch the whole stream. Yeah, or else you'll miss it. You'll miss it. Don't miss it. Um, some shine. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Radiant. Mm-hmm. Bright, powerful. Paladin. Strong. Powerful, sensitive dog, sensitive, <laughs> even. I mean, that's a that's a hero. Self aware, <laughs> confident. But not too proud. Not too proud. No, just the right amount of proud. Proud of yeah. the works that they do. Good listener. Good speaker. 
We love this dog. We love this dog. <laughs> we love this dog. What's this dog's name? Sir Dog. Sir Dog. This is Sir Dog. And we love him. We love Sir Dog. <laughs> we have no choice. We have no choice but to love Sir Dog. Yeah. 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 Do we give a Karina draw? Yeah. 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 Let's do it. Do it. What should Karina draw? What uh, should Karina yeah. draw? Satan's rice cooker. Satan's <laughs> rice cooker. It's Bullion, just a rice cooker, dude. Bullion Martin V2. A rice cooker <laughs> purchased on Satan... a Sunday. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> do you think that Satan would get a like a Hello Kitty rice cooker? I think so. Okay, I'll draw it. <laughs> <laughs> It'll be fun. <laughs> what does Jesus Satan look like? Jacob on a beach. <laughs> <laughs> Toes interlocked. <laughs> what does Toes Satan look like? So funny to me. <laughs> I just love the idea of not noticing that someone was carrying you. <laughs> I'm just going to make Satan a goat. That's Hell what yeah. he looks like, right? Yeah, Satan yeah. can be a goat. Black anyone Phillip. know anyone met Satan? Yeah. I feel like I've met iterations of him. <laughs> Zing. <laughs> nice. Ayoy. Nice. <laughs> uh the age old uh, question. Let me take that again. Look like? I've definitely oh, met Satan. No. My ex wife. Hey! Oh, oh. There it is. There it is. Goat. She was crazy, just like all my exes. Hey, I can relate, I think. I'm very sad. The problem's not with me. <laughs> the problem's not with me. <laughs> just ending every... Oh, my wife. She's always upset with me. It can't be because of something I did. <laughs> she's just emotional. She's the one who's upset, not me. Hello, Audit. She's always nagging me to do basic, decent things. And I'm like, <laughs> uh, who do you think I am? Someone better? <laughs> <laughs> Joke's on you. I'm not. <laughs> I'm worse. I'm worse. Why am I drawing this diagonal? Excuse you, Olive wants your attention. Olive, where, I don't know what you want. That's a great dynamic she pose. Then Diagonal get up. is more interesting. Why but she needs, she needs the proper think... conditions. Thank you. Oh, he's so happy to be Satan. Wouldn't you be? He, yeah, I guess. <laughs> seem he's bad. so much cooler than Jesus. He's like not into feet. <laughs> <laughs> he would never carry someone on a yeah. beach. <laughs> Not carrying people, it's kind of self-care, you know? Yeah, self-care <laughs> Yeah, why carry others when you can carry yourself? Yeah, all of Satan's spoons are the right length. <laughs> <laughs> Satan has as much, as much food as he wants at any given time. Yeah. Look at this Eat one. it without help. I should know what Satan looks like, and here I am making a fool out of myself. This looks like Satan to me. This, yeah, this looks like Satan. I have a tab with Satan on it. I can just use that. Okay. It's just always open. <laughs> Actually, yeah. <laughs> it's just my Satan. It's one of, you know how you like open tabs and then never close them? Yeah. 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 This is a really Satan. That's what, that's what tabs are. They're things you open and never close. Hello, Anib. Stop this, headbutting the microphone. This isn't Satan. This is just satanic. Whatever. I'll just draw a goat. I think had a Satan can thing. probably make themselves look like whatever they want. Satan can be anything. I'm yeah. sure. Can be anything. I'm sure they've <laughs> they've done this look before. Yeah. Yeah, sure. 
this is Black Philip after like the big reveal, and he's just like partying now. This is <laughs> while he's living deliciously. Yeah, this is he's invited you to live deliciously, and he's like, that's his slogan, no, like it. Nike. Live deliciously. Live, live, <laughs> like Taco, Taco Bell. Bell. Live mass deliciously. <laughs> live mass delicious. Would you like to live mass? <laughs> <laughs> just so happy he got a rice cooker he got a rice cooker purchased got, on sunday yeah he got the hello kitty rice cooker that i still am waffling on buying oh Dude, man i've been talking I, about this rice cooker for weeks yeah <laughs> I, I feel like you're gonna i feel like you're gonna get it the amount of time you've spent thinking about getting it it's like karina if you don't get, like it, you I'll want get it, it for you yeah <laughs> We're each going to get you one. Yeah, you're going to get three. <laughs> Suddenly, I have a new problem. <laughs> I still maintain that the rice cooker that Julia got me for my birthday. Yeah. My birthday. I think it was birthday. Is the best present I've ever received. Oh. Based on how often I use it. And how he much, does use it a lot. And how much I enjoy it. Rice cooker? Do you? You don't already have like a different rice cooker, right? No. Or do you, uh, Karina? Um, I I do, uh, but it's not an it's not a good one. It's, it's my roommate's one. old one. Okay, yeah, a good rice cooker. Because yeah. like, we have two rice cookers, I just don't use the nice one because I'm I'm shy. It's just <laughs> it's, it's so just handsome. nice. It's nice to be able to have something you can just like set off and not have to worry about. Yeah. Not like a yeah. pot of boiling water or anything. And then at the end, it's like you could have been doing something and then you got some rice. The rice cooker, uh, the one that's the Hello Kitty rice cooker is the same brand as the one that I got Jacob. Yeah, it's oh, the same brand one. that my roommates have. The one that you hear sometimes that sings. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It's, it's the so good, good. It's the good shit. Oh, Jacob, our food is on the way. Oh, good. Okay. <laughs> good news. Huh? I get the texts after the fact too. <laughs> yeah. They love to send a text that your food is on the way, like an hour after it's arrived. Can I tell you about Olive's big day? Please. Today. Yeah. So we had a, a dude come in to fix our tub because it needs to be resealed because it's been flaking off and whatever so we had to scrape it out and reseal it and whatever um olive is already wary of strangers but then loud strangers terrify her mm -hmm. so she was like i'm gonna go hide under the bed so she bolted uh -huh. under the bed the second the man was in the apartment but then he had to go into the bedroom to put all of his loudest equipment so she was hiding under the bed, shaking, Aww. unable Surrounded to escape. Like a, a screaming tube that was going out the window. Yeah. <laughs> and it's all your of least favorite. It's your scariest part of a horror movie. Yeah, <laughs> <Okay. laughs> true. And she was doing that thing that, that animals do where they just lick a lot because they're really scared. Like they just stick their tongue out a lot. Aww. So Jacob had to fish her out from under the bed with the Swiffer, and then I had to grab her <laughs> and run her into the office. Yeah, because we'd already trapped Joy in the office, and Joy just wanted to like be involved in the process. Of she just wanted to help, doing, which she could not do. Yeah, and um, we had to like do a rescue mission to get Olive and bring her to the office. <laughs> Joy was asleep at some point. She didn't care. Olive was <laughs> hiding on Jacob's desk in the corner shaking with big eyes. It was a very <laughs> sad state of affairs for wow. Olive. But now um, she's okay. I'm glad you, you all made it through it as a family. Karina, this looks like an ad for rice cookers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Even Satan loves it. <laughs> especially like, on Sundays in counties with blue Sundays. laws. <laughs> It makes sense that it's just a regular rice cooker with Hello Kitty sort of decorations. Yeah. But for some reason, I had it in my head that it like had the ears. I wish if that the were the case, cooker. I would have immediately bought it. I wouldn't have had a single thought in my mind. It would have just happened without me. 
I saw that they had a Hello Kitty (laughs) humidifier that had Hello Kitty's like ears and things. I mean, the rice cooker should just be a a Hello Kitty that stands there and you open up the head. Yeah. And put the rice in. They should make one shaped like Batsmaru. Yeah. That's another thing I would just black out and buy (laughs) without a care in the world. I knew someone who would like sleep purchase items. Like yeah. she would go to sleep with the TV on and then, you know, late at night, it would have those like late night commercials. And then in like a couple of days, she would just get random things in the mail <laughs> because she had just saw them and bought them. Interesting. Yeah. That sounds like fun, but that also sounds like a legitimate problem. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I guess it depends what your financial situation is. You can afford was... to live like that. She she so could deliciously. called living moss. Yeah. <laughs> Is this Jesus? Yeah. This is what Jesus looks like. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know what anything looks like. I Jesus think. looks like Jonathan Van Ness. Yeah. According to you know <laughs> Western depictions of Jesus. Jesus is white. Yeah. That's the first thing we need to know. And he's got beautiful blue eyes. Beautiful blue eyes. <laughs> <laughs> And a big beard and long hair. Well, not really yeah, a big beard, like a very well kept beard. Yeah. yeah. Pretty, you know, like a he's like Jesus a well like a 30, 33 year old uh you know, just sort of sort of guy. <laughs> he's just a guy. <laughs> it's a big deal. It's only Jesus. Oh, he's carrying Jacob. Oh, Jesus nice. is very small. Jacob is zoned out. He's not yeah. going to remember he's she being carried. Remember. <laughs> but the footprints. Where did it fo- go? <laughs> Where did it go, Jesus? <laughs> <laughs> you carry me? Wow, you're so strong. Jesus is pissed. Like, yeah, he bought this on a Sunday. <laughs> yeah, he stops carrying you. It's like, sorry, I have to go kick Satan's ass for buying this on a Sunday. I bought this on a Sunday in Edgewater, New Jersey. <laughs> <laughs> it wow. never ceases to please me how specific the images we make on the stream are yeah when it comes to the second wave of drawings you never know what you're gonna get <laughs> yeah it's all callbacks i'm done we reward you. It's, it's rewarding for people who've been <laughs> here the entire stream. I think. Yeah. <laughs> it's incentive to yeah. watch the whole thing. You're welcome. You're Quibble welcome. Time. What should Jacob? Oh, draw? yeah. It is a Jersey Devil. Anyone who buys a rice cooker on a Sunday is a Jersey Devil. <laughs> That's the real Jersey Devil. Famous Jersey resident, the Jersey Devil. <laughs> Let's see. Jacob Malfoy still there. Horse girl Jacob. Horse girl Jacob. Hmm. Hot I have Jersey my drawing devil. In my draw. It's a quick one. Do I want to draw horse girl Jacob? Yeah. Yes. I'll try. I don't even know. Like, I don't even have a conception of what this image will be. It's horse- you if you really like horses. <laughs> Maybe you like the horse, you are the horse. It's well, what because you were talking about how you <laughs> draw yourself looking in a mirror and a horse is looking back. <laughs> you're afraid of what would happen if you doing. let a horse into your heart. Yeah, what I it would do to you. Do. Nobody worry, Karina. That sounded like a weird stock photo image. I'd find, <laughs> I wish. Surely this exists somewhere. Oh, absolutely. I'm just thinking of those angry like Facebook algorithm shirts that are like, I am a horse girl. (laughs) (laughs) What was that 
shirt that I, I found a horse shirt and I sent it to Terrence when I found it because it was just buck wild. I'm a horse girl and I like Deadpool. (laughs) Oh, horse world. I found it. Are you ready for the best sweatshirt I've ever found? Yes. So there's a, a beautiful drawing of a horse that has many colors, but then it said in white and red letters, it says, whoever said diamonds are a girl's best friend. Horse. <laughs> uh, I love it when a shit post just becomes a piece of clothing. <laughs> Amazing. I'll put it in the Discord so everyone can see it. Really and good. Ours and the Drawfee Discord. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I love it. It's like, how do you argue with that? Yeah, I got me there. (laughs) It's worded like all the best Facebook comments. Yeah. (laughs) My favorite Facebook comments are by the like the older people who do not know how to type with a keyboard yet and like are too lazy (laughs) to backspace. So it's like my son space dot space space. Went to the store. <laughs> <laughs> dot, dot, dot. Yeah. It, it's just like it's, it has the wildest pronunciation or um, punctuation. We love to see it. Are you emotional about the horsies? Yeah, of course. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Thinking about horse. Yeah, you almost were a Caldwell. Yeah, I got to watch out for that. Move the mouth down. Now you're Jacob. Move the mouth <laughs> down, move the chin up. That's Jacob. And it's, you know, it's funny because like Jacob does have a pretty nice, nicely sized chin. It's just like, how how can anyone <laughs> compete yeah. with Caldwell? Yeah, that can't be your thing. No. Yeah, no. It's not notable <laughs> enough as a feature. I don't like that hand there. Jacob Hands had wrong. A, Jacob one time like on stream hand. showed how to draw the difference between a Jacob and a Caldwell and he drew the head shape and he drew two ears and then he drew the face and slid it up and it was Caldwell and slid it down <laughs> and it was Jacob and it was very funny to me. Yeah, that's literally it. Yeah. I've got forehead. That's my thing. My yeah. face Jacob? is all down here and the Caldwell yeah. is all up here. <laughs> <laughs> uh This face does need to be slightly adjusted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, there's so much feeling. <laughs> so much feeling in this. Well, yeah, it's because I'm seeing a horse that I've fallen in love with. You've fallen in love mm-hmm. with this it's, majestic You creature. found the horse you can't forget. I found the horse I can't forget. <laughs> horse mafia. <laughs> <laughs> It's just peeing and pooping everywhere. <laughs> yeah, it's out of control. Once you see that, you'll know. <laughs> oh. <Aww. laughs> mm-hmm. You're wearing your, your current outfit, I see. Yeah. Long shirt. It's true to life. This is if I right now yeah. found the yeah. horse that I'll never forget. Yeah, the <laughs> fashion doesn't change. It's just the emotions. Well, this is the moment yeah. that it happened. The moment we'll never forget. Yeah. Moments like this. <laughs> people Slow mo of someone running next to a horse on the beach. <laughs> a moment like this. People are. Uh... Okay. Go ahead, Nathan. No, I want. To, I want you to keep singing. For that one special kiss. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't believe it's happening oh, to me. To me. I'm sure that didn't. Wait a lifetime. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. 
like this. Wow. Like this. A beautiful horse. <laughs> this is um this is a sock Aww. puppet. <laughs> this is a sock puppet. It's so cute. It's a horse. This is a Muppet horse, and I love it. Hello, I Jacob. Love Jacob horse. <laughs> it's beautiful. It's better than any realistic horse I could ever attempt to. Yeah, draw. it's just, it's unmistakable. <laughs> See, now we can do. We can get a little blur effect. People are um, reminding us that uh, that we should raid Willie. Yes. Uh... We can raid Willie. Do a little little Willie raid. Yeah. I need to make it like. <laughs> I was gonna ask, but if we're raiding Willie, it's my friend's birthday, and you should also go check out her stream. Let's go raid her. Oh yeah, we oh, can we raid could... your friend too. Yeah, let's raid your friend. <laughs> it's not Willie's birthday. birthday. It's like not Willie's birthday. Her. We've raided Willie before. <laughs> yeah, Willie. We'll raid your friend Willie instead. famously doesn't notice <laughs> when we raid him. Maybe your friend will. <laughs> so, so many. It was like three raids in a row <laughs> that the second we raided, Willie walked away. <laughs> I mean, it is very. Has funny. he ever? Has he ever noticed when we raided? No, no, no. Because he doesn't look at chat. <laughs> no. It's like that's that's why I like raiding Willie is because it's like for all the people who complain that we don't read chat enough. It's like look at <laughs> look at what you could have. Yeah. We we sometimes look there. When people are telling me no, I will look. I'll look and see that people <laughs> didn't like a thing I said every once in a while. <laughs> once in a while. Um, and that's okay. Everybody's, that's okay. everybody's Twitch expectations are different. And that's what's wonderful about uh, this medium is you can you can really be as interactive as you want. I think the chance to get your suggestion drawn is pretty interactive. <laughs> oh my Personally. goodness. Beautiful. Yeah, I'm, I'm done. Okay, this it's my turn. I'm in love with a horse for the first time. I love this horse. <laughs> <laughs> it's such a good this is, shape. This is the most sense any horse you've ever drawn. It's really shape. good. Thank that you. horse couldn't care less about you and you're in love with it. Not yet. <laughs> the beginning. It's the beginning of something beautiful. Okay. That horse is going to carry you. So someone this whole stream has been suggesting one thing, and it's been highlighted. And I want to do it, but I'm going to do it from memory. Okay. Well, someone Why? really wanted Sid from Ice Age from memory. <laughs> Oh. And I only remember an impression of Sid. Yeah, oh, essence please. of Sid. Essence of Sid from Ice Age. Mm, sniff up that essence. It smells of him. Is People, Sid the, the sloth one. Yeah. Yeah, he's kind of like John. Yeah, yeah. He, you know. Yeah, I know what you're saying. That's the one I'm thinking of. Is it, is it, is it uh, John Leguizamo? Does the voice of Sid? I don't know who that is. Johnny Legs? I'm looking it up. He was at Mocha that time. Uh, Do you guys remember that? Oh, he was. Yeah. He's like an actor and yeah. voice person, but apparently he like wrote a book. And then one of the years we were at Mocha, he was also yeah. nibbling at Mocha for some reason. It I was think so I was bizarre. out getting everyone food when John Leguizamo walked by. Yeah. Sound yeah, like a biography. He, he is the voice of Sid. <laughs> he's also um Julia, this is cute. Yeah, this, this is, is that's how I know Sid. you're wrong. This is not, yeah, this is already <laughs> like oh oh no. Oh no. I I still like it. This is like one of those um 
like spam ads you see for Aww. those uh, those things that make <laughs> photorealistic oh, cartoon characters. He's like, he's got some. Is that the top of his head? I yeah. could have sworn he was bald. No. He's he's a fuzzy. <laughs> he's a fuzzy creature. Hold on, I'm looking him up. I thought that was like a forehead line, and then you were gonna put head on top of that. No. no. Yeah, I mean the thing oh. is, it's not <laughs> okay. It's not no. that far off. It's just like it's <laughs> wow. It's it's imbification. This is <laughs> really <laughs> Oh, I'm very glad you did this, Julia. Thank you. <laughs> Important to end the stream on a on a real highlight. I know it's strong a chin, but it do look a bit like two mouth. That's the second <laughs> mouth. Yeah. For, for liquids. No, no Ju Julia. <laughs> what <that>? is? <laughs> He's got like a double chin going into a a real skinny neck. Yeah, that's a weird combo. Yeah. What's that fat fold? Yeah. yeah. This is a this is a Doctor Who alien. <laughs> Moisturizing. <laughs> <laughs> you know he's supposed to be a sloth. Yeah, but he is. He is. Yeah. Yeah. He is kind of shaped that way. <laughs> Wait, sometimes he's smarmy. No, oh, he's not. No. <laughs> what, what is, what is, oh. Actually, that does make him look more like Sid, weirdly enough. <laughs> uh -huh. It looks like he's saying something sexist. <laughs> I'm not uh -huh. sexist, but. <laughs> Women shouldn't be in the medical field. <laughs> Listen, all, I'm going to say this, and I know what you're going to say, but it, it's not me. Legitimately this time. All of my ex-girlfriends are crazy. <laughs> oh, yeah, make, tired. Them, make them tired. I'd get restraining orders against them if they didn't already have restraining orders against me. <laughs> this is old city. They always do it first for some reason because they're so crazy. He became problematic and his head caved in. <laughs> <laughs> his brain got smushed in there. <laughs> <laughs> this is like People Sid. Saying, Sid would never. It's like, yeah, no, regular <laughs> Sid would never. But this Sid, there's something, there's something wrong. <laughs> Sid from Mario. <laughs> Sid from Mario. What year did Ice Age come out? Two thousand two. Two thousand seven, baby. Two thousand two. Two thousand seven. Hey, person that was requesting Sid from Ice Age, is this what you wanted? They're very get, happy in did chat. You get your money's worth. Did you get your money's you were, worth? You were right. It was two thousand two. Wow, really? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> Jacob, why do you know that? I don't know. That's crazy. <laughs> this literally looks like Sid put through the bonk filter. <laughs> <laughs> you just need the bot camera on his head and it's perfect. <laughs> it's just like a red like toy hammer. Yeah. <laughs> it's like the thing is if we were if we had to guess what character this is. Like I'm pretty sure I would still get Sid. Yeah, I mean it looks like Sid. It's like Sid, <laughs> Sid and E.T. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the hammer, I think, typically doesn't have the nail removal part. It's, it's like a, a toy mallet. It makes it look really brutal. Yeah. Yeah, this one, no, this is a real hammer. <laughs> more, of a, more of a mallet, probably, that we want. But I, I like the construction quality Side hammer this is so funny <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a meat pounder <laughs> just some real the 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 shape of his head and the fact that he's getting hit with a hammer are two separate 
things. <laughs> Tenderize that skull. Yeah, oh, nice and soft. The, the bonk, the blurry bonk. <laughs> <laughs> bonk. Put a porpo in here so we can be done. <laughs> oh my God, Julia. <laughs> you know, it's like, I'm glad, I'm glad you got to, to get your rest. I'm, I'm glad that uh, you're feeling better, but it really, it really goes to show that we don't, we don't get this sort of thing happening when, uh, when you're not here. <laughs> not the same without it's not, you. It's Julia. just not the same. <laughs> <laughs> the bonk got a, content. He's got a different hammer. <laughs> Oh, something's wrong. These hammers are out of control. <laughs> Someone's got to do something about these hammers. <laughs> Our brains. Why did they, why does it make their eyes so? <laughs> yeah. Why does it make their eyes beautiful? <laughs> I don't think that's part of it. <laughs> <laughs> They're doing the same pose and everything. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Oh, uh, thank you all so much for watching. Thank you. Um, we do this every Monday and um I think starting in February, we're we're gonna try and do multiple streams every week. Yes. Um, and of course, check out new videos on our YouTube channel every Tuesday and Thursday. Tomorrow's episode uh, is a real fun one. Yeah. We got to raid Karina's friend. We got oh raid yeah, Karina's let me go friend. type it in for their birthday. Wish them. Happy What's birthday. your friend's twitchy? A sippy tree. C Y P uh, C Y P I tree C Y P R I tree. Yeah, I think that's correct. I oh, we're doing that. it. We got it. We we're got doing it? it. Yeah, wish your happy in. birthday. It's like I a cypress tree, but without this. this... Just doing the Hades fan art. Oh, nice. nice. Yeah, everybody give your best <laughs> birthday wishes. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And that's it for us. Let's do the raid. We're sorry. Bye, everybody. We're sorry. Bye.